When you ask most human beings what an ideal education system is, how they learn, they learn best by doing, they learn best by working with people who have expertise in that area, they learn best collaborating. Why don't our schools look like that? Well, here at City of Bridges, schools do look like that. I'm Dr. Randy Bartlett. I am the head of school and founder of City of Bridges. I'm Justin Masek. I am the uh, student advocate here at City of Bridges. City of Bridges High School is located in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania in a modern, flexible space here in the vibrant Southside neighborhood. And our students are learning by doing. Our students are doing real work with real practitioners, in addition to working with educators like Justin and myself. They also work with professional practitioners, with writers, with physicists, with attorneys. In addition, our students are engaged in meaningful and relevant internships. Starting in ninth grade, they're able to experience what it means to work in local government, what it means to work in a restaurant, what it means to work in an attorney's office, so that they can determine what those possible futures that they want to explore actually look like. Often gifted students are given the opportunity to have small class sizes and have work with professionals and have this flexible learning curriculum where they can solve interesting problems. Um, and so we asked the question, like, if that is our ideal model of education, then why don't we give that to all of our students? Because learning can be an enjoyable experience, but a large part of that is giving students the agency to shape the school environment to fit what they think is best for them. So for instance, every week we have a student governance meeting where the students can make actual tangible decisions on City of Bridges and what learning looks like. And the students at City of Bridges are also prepared with those academic skills, with math, with science, with English, with social studies, with foreign language, so that they can go on and open any door and really enable them to envision whatever possible future and how to bring that future to fruition. City Bridges is more than just a high school, it's a community learning organization. And as we continue to grow and expand our programming, we'll be extending this real work, practitioner-based, personalized, hands-on model to people of all ages. But in order for us to do that, we have to find a new way of supporting this work. And so that's what brings us to Patreon. City of Bridges is an independent school. We're a nonprofit organization, we're a 501c3, but we're an independent school. That allows us the freedom and the flexibility to provide everything that we've been talking to you about. But it also means that we need to find ways to support our work. We believe in and we practice universal hospitality, universal access. We don't turn students away because of their income. Regardless of what you're able to contribute, we welcome you into this community. But that means we need to develop ways to ensure that we can always continue to do this work. And Patreon is one of those ways. So we're on Patreon, and there are two reasons we hope you would support us. One, if you support forward-thinking, progressive education, that would make a huge difference in what we do. The second reason to support us on Patreon is because there's also going to be a lot of great content. The young people here are creative, they're enthusiastic, they make amazing art and music and podcasts and videos, they write poems and short stories, they do really incredible things. Those demonstrations of learning will be available to the patrons. In addition, because we're a larger community learning organization, we have lots of other people who are eager to contribute content to our Patreon, to contribute lectures and art and music and lessons, all of which will be available and accessible. So please, join us in this community, join us in supporting this work. And thank you so much for watching. Thank you.